Hello, my name is Pony7, and welcome back to IL2 Battle of, uh, well, technically it's Tank Crew, not Battle of Kaban. I'm just used to saying Battle of Kaban. Tank Crew. Um, I found some more non historical missions. So there's one for, well, Tiger and Panzer III, just cap to capture uh, Severosk. And there's one for the KV 1 which, and T 34, which is to clear Stalingrad. So. I'll probably do both because I'm in, I'm enjoying Tank Crew so far. The uh, I haven't played, but I might have found another one. I'll have to uh, <laughs> download and uh, try it out. And the reason why we're in this screen is because I have quickly tested this mission just to make sure that it actually works. It wouldn't do to go to record the mission, then nothing happened. So just basically went and tested it to make sure it works, and things are all go from the start. So that's why we're here. This gives me a chance to set up a little bit. Oh, that's fine for the paint scheme. Take APHE. And, I mean, realistically, we shouldn't need anything else. I don't think there's going to be anything. I'm going to take a full load. Just in case. You never know what's going to come up. But, realistically, we don't really need anything else. Not until we get much more heavily armored and heavily angled tanks. And even then we'll probably stand a fair old chance of penetrating them. So let's get the mission started. <laughs> Excuse me. Let's get the mission started. There we go. Unpause. And then break the defenses. And capture the town hall. I have made a little bit of concession. Uh, no, don't open the hatch. Stay in the hatch. Close the armored visor. I've been a little bit of a concession to, uh... To, uh, gameplay here. I've enabled this for, uh, tank crew. The, uh, indicator panel, but I've turned off the markers and all that to make sure that with it on, I don't accidentally, uh, able to see where everything is because that wouldn't be uh, too fair of me first stage is simple just kill all the enemies that was high let's move up a little bit so I can actually see a little bit better Looks like he might have, been, might have been taken out. That was a direct hit. Oh, there's one in the trees, I think. Yes, there was. Don't see anything else. Wait, nope. There's a Panzer IV, which just took a hit from... That looks like a KV. Maybe 800 meters? It was 800 meters. Alright. Alright, roll up. Let's see what else we can find. Hopefully, uh, something else. I do also have the map up. Again, that won't give me any icons. That's just to make sure I don't get lost. Because uh, turning off the icons of the tanks also turns off the uh, navigation aids. Oh, I don't have the gun depression. I'm supposed to be recording. There we go. Anybody else? I don't see anything. I mean, there's Katushas, but this is a bit far of range for my liking, for accuracy's sake. No, well, it looks like we're good. All right, and check our back on. Yeah, these vision slits are not the best. These are really not the best. 
KV-1 has much better vision out of the turret. Coppola. Much, much better vision. But then now we don't have this uh, blind spot to our side, because we can literally just lean up and look over it. So that's nice. So anyway, forwards. To glory. And possibly death. Who knows? Only, uh, time and, uh, the fates. And the mission maker. Because he made the mission, so he decided whether or not we're gonna get, uh, blown to smithereens by a rocket strike as soon as we touch, um, the bridge or not. Uh, like those ones. Which are blowing up where we just were. Good thing we left there. Uh, it might have been very explosive for us if we had not. So far nothing. Which is good. Um, that... Well, uh, hold up for him. I think there was a Panzer directly inside the uh, strike location there, so he's dead if he was. Or badly work, wounded, which is also basically dead on the uh, Russian front. I just noticed the gear lever. I'm guessing that's for the commander's override. Because there's no way that's the gunner's position right there. I'll have to have a look when I get down inside of it. And there's our bridge. So over to the left a little bit. Looks a bit on the flank. That is good. That is definitely good. We don't want to be out flanked. And we've left the, uh... Well, we've left the, uh... Panzer is far behind. And more Katushas. Many, many, many Katushas. All of the Katushas all the time. Alright, here's our bridge. There is definitely enemies on the other side, so button up. And yeah, that is definitely the commander's override. There's no way that's the gunners. No way that's the gunners, uh... Frank. You can see nothing of the Tigers and Polar buttoned up. Don't drive off the bridge. Alright, and to the gunners position. Take control. And start murdering. And send it. And send. That was high. That one got him. That one is dead. One last one. Keep him the MGs a little bit. And he's now dead. There we go. Get that up and going. And forward, Striver. Panzers are slowly catching up. They'll get here eventually, I hope. A little bit of a bump on that uh, bridge there, but I'm sure it's fine. Oh. There's now a uh, river patrol. Alright. And an anti aircraft gun. So let's uh, button up again. Gunner's position. And swing the turret round. 
and swing and swing all right so boats about a thousand meters survey says Short. There we go. And send it. Oh, he didn't die. The cheeky bugger. You're supposed to die when I hit you. You didn't die again. Listen, you're not playing this game right. You're supposed to be dead. There we go. Finally got the game. And turn out. Is that from behind us? It, what? Who killed him? Oh, there's an anti-tank gun. Swing it around. Where did? Where is it? Fire again. Oh, it's right there. I'm blind. That was two separate hits. No, it's just that fast firing. It's now also very dead. Alright, that looks to be that. Let's unbutton again. Oh, he died. And he died as well. I think almost port has died. Oh, well. I'm sure we're fine. Forwards, driver. Yeah, we're perfectly fine. Now, any more anti-tank guns hiding for me? Lying in wait. Nothing over there. So far, nothing else. Probably go crush the anti aircraft gun and swing through the town. Try and find the town center. I thought I saw something moving over there. There is something moving over there. Driver, what did you do? Angle the armor. Nope. Not that. Button up. It's a KB-1S. Or rather, no, it's a regular KB-1. Or is it a 1S? Either way, it's dead. Anything else? Yes, right there. You didn't die. That's surprising. That's very surprising. Oi, stop shooting me with your machine gun. Anything else? I think we're good. Right. Now, back to our itinerary. We go crush the anti-aircraft gun. And possibly literally crush it. 
and then onwards to the town center. It's a simple plan, but simple plans are generally the best plans because then there's uh, less things to literally throw a monkey wrench sometimes into. So far I see no anti-aircraft. Wait, there it is. Hmm, can we shoot it or run it over? Choices, choices. Hello, Ivan. Yes, yes, don't worry. Don't worry, I'm just here for a cruise. There's a lot of bombs here. Probably shouldn't touch them. They might go boom and take me with them. I think I'm gonna go with uh, Crush. Run it down. And see what see what happens. For science, four words. Oh. What shot us? Where? Anti tank gun front. I was too focused on the anti-aircraft gun. I didn't see the anti-tank gun. Now then, this, hold on. Button the commander up, lest he get blown to smithereens by the blast. This is for betraying me like that. Right. Forwards once more, and hopefully not into more hidden anti-tank guns. Because while our armor is strong, I don't know how much it can take. Uh, machine gunner is still okay. I guess you can see out of that, that periscope. That looks kind of nice. Driver. Let's just see out of this periscope. It's actually useful. Of course, uh, I don't have track air set up the best. So, uh, there's some small bugs where it just decides to go off on its own. Either way, once more into the breach. Time to find some more targets. And somewhere in here, there's a town split center. Where? I have no clue. Probably towards the center of the town. I mean, we just gotta look for the fuel and uh, trucks that were. Right? Where'd you go? Where the dickens did you go? Well, four words. Find it. There's an anti aircraft gun. Maybe. Okay, that house is actually still alive, so it's a hitbox. Very odd hitbox. That was high. I don't know why I thought that was farther away than it was. Right. But you're not the thing that shot me. Is 
There it is. Hi again. Well, he's now dead. Right, once again, forwards and into the town. Unless there's more anti-tank guns on my flank. Don't think so. So in we go. Don't see nothing yet, which is good. I'm just going to guess we're going to have to go towards the center of the town. Because that's roughly where our town center would be. In the center of a town. That makes sense. Come on. Don't die on me now, Tiger. I know you're taking a lot of hits, but uh, stay with me. Be the building ahead. Maybe. Oh, hello. You know, you have a really bad time right now. Something else shot us. I don't know where from. What is shooting us? What is shooting us and where is it? or something. Is that, oh, there's a uh, fuel storage. I think we found it. There's definitely going to be combat here, so, uh, button up again. Yep, there's a sound center. Found you at last. Oh, and it's, uh, it's a little truck. With a cannon on it. You're now dead. There's uh, Ivan again. Oh, there's another one. That was high. He's now dead. And also the machine gun truck. And these guys. So now, forwards, driver. Let's uh, crush, let's see if these guys can be crushed. Hello, Ivan, you're gonna have a bad day. It looks like they might be able to in time. Yes, hi. You're having a bad day. That was low. Let's just leave these trucks. Okay, I'm actually aiming slightly over it because of how close we are. Right, you're dead.
Did I pass through it? There is a distinct possibility. Hmm. Alright, listen. Listen, I know you want to get my attention. But all you're going to do is get yourself killed. There we go. That should be mission completed. And there we are there, driving up from underneath the trees. Not too bad of a mission, and actually I was kind of right to bring the full load of ammunition because um, that took roughly half our ammunition load. So I think it was a good call to bring the extra ammunition. And there we go. Mission complete. Let's see what we, what we did. We got one transport, uh, four light armored, one medium armored, that'd be the T. Hmm. Don't remember what that was. And then five KP1s. And then one machine gun. <laughs> um, mostly destroyed two light uh, ships. Uh, four cannons, two AA guns, and five rocket launchers. That's going to do it for this mission. And, uh, this little aside, thank you all for having helped the channel reach 100 subscribers. It's the first little milestone of the channel. And now it's much easier to link, not only for myself, but if I want to link it. Rather than being a random mishmash, it's now just Pony7. So it's quite nice. So thank you all. Um, I mean, feel free to ask questions and I'll do my best to answer them. It doesn't have to be about, specifically, this could be like something random like, what food do you eat? Well, that'd be a bit specific, oh so. But, thank you all for the passing 100, in fact, 105 at the time of recording. And, I hope to see you all next time.